explained with is a short video where i challenge myself by trying to explain some random topic from science or engineering with a simple analogy and today we are going to talk about the random access memory you probably would have learned about the differences between ram and rom and how they are called the primary and the secondary memory and all that but if you are still confused as to what they actually mean well imagine there is a whole pot of biryani that you can eat from and you have one plate for yourself there are also some other dishes like salad pappadam and some gravy your goal is to have a real good meal so you naturally try to fit as much as you can into your plate without everything overflowing the plate that you eat from is analogous to the working memory aka the primary memory or the ram the ports containing food are akin to how data is stored in secondary memory like hard disks and solid state drives you store all the pictures that you take with your camera in a hard disk which is kind of similar to how you store all the extra biryani in the pot for eating at dinner later on in order for you to eat the biryani you first need to take it from the pot and serve it in your plate so that you can access it easily and start eating it's easier to eat from a smaller plate than a huge pot similarly in order for a program to quote and quote run you need to take the corresponding code from wherever it is stored in the disk and place it in the ram so that the cpu can access it easily and execute that code different programs might need to read data from different devices and use them all together as well so what is the difference between a laptop with a smaller ram size say 4 gigs and another laptop with say 32 gigs of ram you can see this as different people having plates of different sizes if you are using a smaller plate the amount of food that you can have in your plate at any certain instant of time will be smaller compared to what you can have in a larger plate you also have enough space to have multiple different dishes at the same time in a larger plate if you have say a lot of different tabs open in your browser or are running several applications simultaneously your computer may tend to freeze or go unresponsive this is akin to having too much in your plate and ending up not being able to eat one thing properly so the next time you encounter a primary and secondary storage device remember that the ram is your working memory and the other drives are where you can store all your data even if you don't need them right away so that was ram and rom explained with biryani in 2 minutes if you are new to this channel i am sridham i am a final year engineering student from kerala do like and subscribe if you want to see more such videos where i try to explain something in a fun and relatable manner goodbye and thanks for watching